It is often said that Google Glass is not capable of augmented reality, which includes, to paraphrase Wikipedia, augmenting a live view of a physical environment with graphical annotations. In this and our previous AR videos, we demonstrate that Glass can be used for AR applications. We attach Glass to this DSLR to give you a user's point of view. Here we demonstrate real-time rectification using a native Glass application. What the user sees through the prism is a small region contained by the camera frame. Using a homography we computed in a one-time calibration step, we can extract the region that corresponds to the user's view and display it in real time. This is the foundation of AR on glass. Being able to sample camera frames and use a homography to relate coordinates in the frame to coordinates in the user's view. We can then use the camera frame and available sensors to augment the user's view with corresponding virtual information. We now demonstrate interactive augmented reality. On your left is a DSLR frame. The central region is the augmented view projected by glass and the annotation canvas is superimposed. An annotator draws on a canvas which is sent to glass as an overlay. Camera frames are streamed from glass to a server where they are matched to the annotation image. The server sends the resulting homography back to glass and the annotation is rectified using the previously described approach. On the bottom right, we see the annotator draw a circle over the US and Russia. When the annotator finishes dragging, the overlay is sent to glass. The annotation overlay is drawn on a prior frame. To display it on the user's current view, we compute a homography between the prior and current frames. In this prototype, we stream the camera frames to a server to perform matching. Over Wi-Fi, the delay is about 4 seconds. In this example, a physical tic-tac-toe board is drawn and the game is played with a remote user. We are able to augment the marker board with the remote moves, visually unifying the physical board and the virtual canvas. Superimposed on the top right is the annotation canvas, and on the bottom right is an image that shows the remote user the current state of the board. This approach allows the glassware to receive information about what they are looking at in an intuitive way. This enables a variety of applications. For example, Someone with glass can shop at a store for several people who are able to visually direct the wearer to items they would like. Another example is helping a friend assemble furniture by visually displaying which pieces go together. Another is a family member helping you cook one of the recipes by pointing out which ingredients to use and where to put them. Next we demonstrate our approach by displaying information on the Apollo Lunar Module. Using our approach we annotate an image with information about the exhibit. As the glassware looks at the exhibit, it is augmented with relevant information. In these examples, matching is performed over 3G, and unlike the previous examples, the delay is removed for display purposes. We are currently extending this approach to perform matching on the user's phone to remove the transfer delay. We can show a museum visitor a path they should take through the exhibits. AR doesn't have to be informative, it can be fun too. Next we show how multiple glasses can be used to extend the spatial area available. This is particularly useful for augmented reality because it provides greater coverage over the user's view. Open Glass is designed to support multiple glasses per user. Annotation overlays are defined per user and matching is performed independently for each glass. Since the camera and display are fixed, the homography between them is the same. To improve matching, we use the accelerometer to detect the device orientation and correct the image in homography since the left eye's glass is upside down. Since the glasses are used binocularly, we aren't able to show the user's view with the DSLR like we could with a single glass. Since they are independently positioned, it is possible to extend the apparent visible area horizontally or vertically. Okay, glass. Take a picture. Okay, glass. Take a picture. Okay, glass. Share with Open Glass. Subscribe to see more videos like this and visit our site for more information.